Hi everyone, Glenda in Weston here. How are you all? I hope you realise why I'm late. I did put on earlier. Just been to see Gemini Man and in my opinion, absolutely fantastic. Went a little bit slow in the middle, so I nearly sort of fell asleep, so I'm a bit tired. But other than that, really, really good film. Really good twists and things going on. Talk, typical Will Smith, really. Definitely worth going to see or watching it on Netflix or Now TV or Sky or whatever it is you've got. But yeah, it is a really good film. Thank you for Kaz and Teresa for another lovely night out. Always try and get at least once out, at least once a month. Try and catch up with each other. Sorry about that. For some reason, my phone decided to go into a pause mode. I don't know what's going on there. Right, so I've had trouble with the writing, as you know. So hopefully it's the right way around. That's because I've written it backwards. I've actually had to write it backwards on my board. I did buy a little iPhone pod thing. Blooming useless. It's only goes up to six or something ios six i need ios nine hi julie hi beverly um so i've got to go tomorrow and try and get a decent or slightly better iphone so i can actually switch the screen around so i hope this actually does read right which is why it's trial and error because i've written it all backwards just so you can actually see it the right way around which is why i've got loads of stuff written on there that i'm not really going to talk about just yet hi marie hi becky all right um <clears throat> So if anything, anyone knows what type of iPhone I actually need, I don't want a nice basic one that actually flips the screen because the, the pod doesn't work. The pod touch doesn't work. It doesn't even download Facebook because it's not got enough memory or whatever it is. So iPhones are driving me potty. I know there's a reason I didn't like them. But the trouble is with the Android, it doesn't flip the screen. So hence the backwards writing. Right, what I'm going to finish off with talking about from last week, I was talking to you about the cleaning products we did um, with Essence. And I've actually got mine come through. So I've got the kitchen and I've got the bathroom cleaners. You see absolutely huge size bottles. My head, you see the size. Um, <laughs> but they are, they are totally concentrated. They smell really nice. Got very faint smell of citrus from the bathroom one and really strong citrus from the kitchen one. So I don't know how much I'll use of them because I'm not a big fan of citrus myself. But they go into simple bottle, easy squirt bottle. Only had 50 minutes, all labelled on the side here. I know you can't see it on here, but you can when you close up, you do feel it there. Tells you exactly how much. Oh, thank you, Jeanette. <laughs> it took me a little while to get it backwards, but we got there. Um, and just top it up with water and just spray and go. So it's quite good. Okay. You also get with the pack an easy measure and a pump so if you're going to buy the um washing liquids the, uh, for the laundry the laundry covers which of course come in three different types you've got an easy pump just to pump it straight into your machine no faffing about with sticky messes okay so that's really all i'm going to do is finishing off from last week with about the cleaning stuff armory very kindly which is now going to show backwards just to prove that i've written that backwards up there has done me a full sheet so it just explains how the breakdown works okay so how much product you need to how much water and how much you'll actually get out of it <clears throat> so the kitchen cleaner i've got there it's eight pound ninety to buy the bottle concentrated but once you've diluted it down and use it it only works at one pound eleven p and it is a really good cleaner it does come up you know it does do the surfaces you don't get that slime grime or you know stickiness or anything afterwards so it's really nice i've got a full list here if anybody wants a copy of that i can email that over to you just so you know exactly what products you can use and how much you can actually get out of each of the concentrated bottles on all of our cleaner products so i'm going to talk to you a bit more today about our beauty side of things and the perfumes which is one of our biggest sellers which is what all this is on the back here okay so our <clears throat> Um, perfumes are 20% aromatic essence for the men and for the women so both both of you or everyone is going to get a good strong decent perfume okay um it's broken down into three sections so you've got your top notes excuse me reading my notes but i have been to the pictures i couldn't revise all this so you've got your top note your middle note and your base note which most people know about anyway your top note is your initial sense the middle note works two to three hours in intensity and just sort of breaks down gradually from there. And then your base note is your strongest scent of the all three. So when you look in the perfumes, you want to be looking at what sort of flavours you like. Flavours, excuse me, scents. That's my mother talking about, it's flavours. What type of scents you like, whether you like florals or woody type flavours or citrusy flavours. 
And I'm going to keep saying flavours because it's just coming out naturally now, all right? So I do apologise, but you know exactly what I'm talking about. Hello, Vicky. How are you? You all right, love? Hi, Catherine. Um, so when you're choosing your fragrance, obviously you're looking for the type of notes that you like, the scents that you enjoy. So quite a fragrance you don't really like. Now, I was reading through the book and I was quite surprised um, about the best places to actually apply your perfume. I mean, you've got your obvious ones, you've got your neck. Um, your neck and your wrists. I have heard about people putting it behind their ears, which, to be fair, I don't even think about myself. On your elbows and on your ankles, because they're really good places to get close to your circulation to actually help you know, the scent move around your body, as it were. And you should always put your clothes on after you put your perfume on. So you put your perfume on first, allow it to absorb into your, into your skin, and then put your clothes on. I have also been told by someone else you should never put it directly onto skin, put it straight on your clothes. So I think that's going to be a personal issue for everybody individually. You know, if you want it straight on your clothes, it's straight on your skin, it's entirely up to you. It, it, it's going to depend on you, really, isn't it? But apparently you do get a longer lasting scent if you put it directly onto your skin and then put your clothes on. You can also extend that smell with our shower gels and body mists that smell exactly the same as your perfume itself or your fragrance, if you're a gentleman. So we do do the shower gels that match your scents for the gentleman as well. Okay. So, <laughs> excuse me. All right, so our perfumes. So we've got the Parfum, which I'm going to read again, I'm afraid, is the highest quality and most intensive fragrance that can be purchased on any market. So it doesn't matter what perfume you've got, Oh, okay, Catherine, fair enough. I'm glad you're listening, love, all right? <laughs> it's good to see you. Um, so, yeah, so you've got 15 to 40% of the Parfum in all our scents, okay? Um, your EDP, which is your Eau de Parfum, is, contains the fifth, 12, is, uh, this one, it's 12 to 15% of the fragrance essences. You have the Eau de Toilet, the Eau de Toilette, if you want to be quite, yeah should say it, is your 6 to 12% of fragrance. Your EDC is your Eau de Cologne, which is simply known as Cologne generally and contains 4 to 6% of your fragrance. Your EDS is your Eau de Solids, which is just the 1%, and it's generally used for sports. Um, uh, just It's just a little quick splash on, I suppose, when you're actually exercising or keeping busy or anything like that. Okay, so... All this information is actually in our book, so you can look it up yourself. So if you have the brochures, have a little look through. We also have a full selection of all the different types of scent we do. So you can work out your, your notes, whether it's a top, a middle or a base note. So we've got floral, oriental, fruity, citrus, green, saffron, I can't pronounce that one, F-O-U-G-E-R-E, -E, if someone knows how to pronounce that, give me a shout later. Aqueous and Woody. And as you can see, it's all there. All the numbers are there are associated to the actual perfumes we do. Now, all our perfumes are inspired by many different high-range brands. If you want a list of those, again, message me and I'll send you a list over. Um, and if you actually want to smell our perfumes, just give me a shout because we do have this absolutely fantastic kits with all the scents in there. The blue ones are for the gentlemen, the clear ones at the bottom here are for the ladies. I'm afraid we do have a few more for the ladies than we do for the men, so. But all the scents here, you can not only get in the actual scent itself, you get them in the shower gels, you can get them in the body mists, and I think you get them in the body balms as well for the ladies. So we can smell absolutely amazing as always. It's always good, it's always good. I think the dog just came for a wander. Sorry, Bella. Uh, yeah, she's having a little wander through. We also sell these in the actual kits. Those beautiful sets. And you get an op different options. If you go to my Totally Essence um, Instagram, you'll see I've put the pictures of these up there with all the different types of covers you can actually get to go with your gift set. If you want to buy them for Christmas presents, it's a really good time to buy them because with Brexit coming, it's great to spare everybody trucks could be held up we're having a couple of issues at the moment with trucks being stuck at borders um so it might be worth seriously thinking about ordering sooner rather than later if you want to book the kit from me then please give me a shout 
not a problem. I can get it booked out to you, but bear in mind, I've only got a couple of kits. Hazel's actually got one of my kits up in Cardiff at the moment. So, Hazel, if you're watching, if you see this, can, you know, I need to get back, need to get it back. You know, Marie's coming up, I think, isn't she? So, we'll get her to bring it back with her. We also do our slightly higher range products and scents. Okay, this is our Uniques um, for, for the men and the ladies. And we have our Niche. Remember what was called there? Also for men and women. Okay. So these are slightly more expensive scents, but obviously really, really good quality, as is everything else. If anyone's got any questions, please let me know. If you watch on replay, just drop me a hash replay at the bottom, just so I can keep up with who's keeping up with me. It's great to chat to you all. It is a little bit shorter than normal tonight because it's a bit late. I don't want to keep you all hanging around. Enjoy your Sunday evening. Hope you've all had fabulous weekend i know i did because i spent it all with the kids and the grandkids and playing and it's been brilliant and we were jumping jacks earlier on which is absolutely nuts so thanks for tuning in thanks for seeing it's just lovely to see you all i'll get my words out speak to you all again soon bye guys